So what am I dragging home today? You're about to find out. Hi everybody. It is an absolutely gorgeous day here in South Central Michigan. Uh, the temperatures up until today, the last week or so, have been 95 and 100 with high humidity. And today uh, it's forecasted to be 75 degrees. The humidity is down. It's very comfortable. So what am I doing today? Well, I bought another moldboard plow. And you're going to say, why? Well, a um, couple of reasons. Um, I wanted a plow to be able to participate in the FFA plow days when they have them. And I have a little bit of plowing to do around here. Uh, it also keeps me kind of... Uh, it's a it's a thing to get me back to my childhood days when we used to moldboard plow um, and the price man the price was incredible on this plow it's going to cost me more to fill up my truck than it costs for this plow um, you can probably do the math I got a real steal on this plow and it's in it's in a good shape I already went over, looked at it yesterday and bought it, and the guy says, well, bring your trailer over and I'll load it up. Well, my trailer is at the job site. We're uh, currently working on a house, tearing all the old aluminum siding off, and I needed a trailer to put all that aluminum siding on. So, beautiful day. Uh, let's just go for a ride in the country with a 3020. He lives about four, maybe five miles away. So I'm gonna bring you along and I'll shoot some footage of what the local farmers are growing. Uh, and just a nice little uh, ride over, pick up the plow, and I hope you uh, stick around for the ride. So the first thing I got to do is I have to remove that hydraulic cylinder. It's the only hydraulic cylinder I have, and uh, it's on this Oliver 252 disc, which is going to be another project. I need to replace bearings and disc blades, and I know that it's, again, one of those money pit things maybe i mean probably i could find another disc for as much money as i'm going to stick into it but oliver made a good disc and i just don't like to throw things away that can be fixed so i'm going to grab on i'm going to grab onto this hydraulic cylinder put it on the tractor and get on the road <laughs>
we made it home. Nice little ride through the countryside. I guess you're getting the first good look at this plow. Uh, F145, 416, rusty, but I don't really care. I'm not in love with new paint. As long as it does the job, I'm fine with that. So I took it uh, behind the barn. There's a spot where we're not growing anything and uh, stuck it in the dirt. It does turn dirt just fine. Obviously, I didn't do enough to scour the bottoms, but I did do enough to see that everything is working as it should. I'll probably replace that colder at some point in time if I can find one to match the others. And I'm sure at some point in time I'll replace the shares and the shins. And uh, other than that, I'm thinking it's going to be a user just the way it is. I could take it over to my dad. He'd probably clean it all up and paint it for me. He likes to do that stuff even at 97 years old. So if you're still watching, I want to thank you for following along. If you're not yet a subscriber, I'd greatly appreciate it if you would become one. And uh, until the next time, y'all take care and God bless.